All right, welcome everyone. As you can see, qualifying is over. Tokyo Expressway Nightway, Nightway. Tokyo Expressway Night, Central Inner Loop. I've never driven this track before, especially at night. And during all my friends, during free practice, I qualified second, or I was ranked second among all my friends with a 120.043. But in qualifying, I'm pretty happy with this. Six, not too bad. No penalties. There was a lot of traffic out there. A lot of people hitting the walls, which was kind of messing up your time because you had to back off a little bit. Uh, but I did pretty well. Never driven here before. Qualified six. The soft tires are amazing on this track. I'm not sure what the... Uh... Let's go check them out. Let's go check the details out real quick. Uh, tire wear is 10, so we probably won't do softs unless we pit really late. So I'm going to do mediums, and I'm going to try and do, uh, yeah, medium tires, and then maximum soft. So we'll do medium first, and then we'll try and do a late pit and do soft tires. We're not, we're not going to have to worry about fuel because it's four times, so I think we're good. So all we have to do is worry about tires and watching uh, for people hitting the walls and effing up your race so it's gonna be crazy it's a super tight track not a room, not a lot of room to pass I'm the only Viper in the field and I don't know any of these people that are uh, in this race so 10 seconds actually five seconds we will start season three round eight Round eight of season three. It's a night race. I'm the only Viper in the field, starting in sixth spot. A tight, tight road course or city circuit through the Tokyo City. Tokyo Expressway. This is going to be really interesting. I hope a lot of people are uh, respectable out there. It's going to be really wild. There's not a lot of uh, light. There's the Viper, loving the yellow headlights. My helmet design that I designed. Ooh, there's a pretty wild looking Corvette. Didn't really see what my best lap was because I was too busy flashing my headlights. Out of these racers, out of these top 20 racers right here, I'm third in the points. So, Looking to do well, have a clean race, and work on getting my purple achievements up. A pole would be great. Fast lap would be awesome here. A podium would be sweet. Obviously winning the race, everyone's goal. About to go. Three more. Contestants, 18th, trying to get focused, wow, only 18 this time, no 20, just 18. It's a pretty fast track, I think third gear is the lowest gear you're in. Starting P6 from Tokyo Express, night, enjoy the race.
hard to get involved with the app, dude. Oh, I told you it's gonna be chaos. Oh, oh, guys, hold, hold on, hold on. Everybody's slowing down. Whoo, man, I had to dodge those gun ghosts and cars. too wide there. Hey! Got a penalty coming up. Penalties.
Ouch. I'm gonna do one more lap. Actually, I'm gonna keep stay out a little bit. I'm gonna try and put some softs on for the last stint. Should we go softs? Let's do it. <laughs> Let's figure it out. We'll just try it. We'll try. We got nothing to lose. See if we can make these softs last.
lapping traffic. Trying to take care of these tires, baby. Two more laps. I need my go-kart teammate, Matthew Roberts, to tell me to bring it home since we did that for a third place at uh, Atlanta Motorsports Park 10-hour race in October.
Oh man, ouch. Woohoo! Alright, P3! No penalties, couple of wall hits, but who didn't hit the wall during that race? Wow, man, there was some really close calls. We're gonna have to watch the replay for sure. I can't believe I was able to sneak by some of those uh, cars that hit the wall. Man, everyone was real respectable. That was a great race. I feel pumped. So pumped that I think I'm going to do the daily race, Nürburgring 24, after the stream. All right, P3. That's going to yield some great results, great points. Maybe even get me to level 39. Wow, 643. Fantastic. Only eight. Oh, did I get it? Level 39! Yes! Level 39, guys. Wow. Woo! Oh yeah, let's save this replay. Oof. Go watch the replay. Ooh, let's get a daily race. Workout. Which car should we get? A Lambo. Hey baby. No Lambo. The MSX. All right, let's go watch this replay. Here we go, Tokyo Expressway night. We're gonna watch a real good battle in the dark. A couple of close calls. Actually, I was pretty, pretty uh, by myself for the majority of the race. Switching from mediums to suit, uh, softs was a great strategy. Ooh, look how sweet that car looks right there around that corner. Dang. Might have to take a picture of that just and save it for me. There we go. Starting six. Went all the way up to third. Got bumped from behind on the opening lap twice by, I think, a uh, headbuster. Here we go, and we're green down the first corner. Woo, man, look at all these lights. It looks super cool. He's really wanting to get by me. Ooh, man, look at that. Neck and neck. There's going to be a collision up here somewhere. Oh, he bumped me right there. He got bumped me. He got a penalty. The Mustang bumps me. Oh, he bumped me right there. I snake inside. Oh, I'm hanging on. Oh, man. So they both got penalties, which means at the penalty block, they're going to slow down and I'm going to go around them and get my position back, which I think that's great that they do that. It lets you know where it's going to be because in the past, cars could slow down at any point on the racetrack and you would bump them because you didn't know they were slowing down. There they go. Back to six. Onward and upward. I'd 
like this looking sweet with those yellow lights. I really like this livery that I found on the Discover page. I would love to see a manufacturer's race on the Nürburgring at night. Holy crap. You know how wild that would be? In fact, I'm going to go race the daily race in 24 GT3 car after this stream. I might stream it too. Another stream. So here we are battling for six. This Mustang's right all over me. Had a great run out of that corner. Put a little bit of distance between us. Hug that corner, fly down here, up to six gear. Man, look at this. He's, the car handles so well. Oh, hit the wall, so they put a little bit more between us. Let's see, how do I get third? I think I did it when I came out of the pits, maybe? Or they, oh no, there's another, there's another uh, crazy incident coming up. Ooh, what a great view right there. You know, this is the real Tokyo Expressway. All these different versions and iterations. This is the real... These are real streets in Tokyo. It's crazy. I'm within striking distance of you, buddy. <laughs> Here I come. All over you. I think we have a pretty good battle here. Look at this. This is the battle for third right here. We got four cars. I wonder if Nür the Nürburgring race is going to be uh, a different time of day versus daylight. I wonder if it'll be like dusk or dawn or something. That could be really cool. Oh, look at this. Get around six right there. Boom. Here we go. I think he had a penalty. I've been following this guy. Within striking distance. Here's some action. Oh, yeah, they're hitting the wall. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're battling hard. Oh, go. Did I get it? Oh, look at this. Dang. Did I? I think I got right in there. Maybe we should go back. Should we go back? Let's. Oh, look at this. Oh, here it is. Oh, and then the inside. Holy mackerel. Alright, let's go back to that. Look at all this battle. Let's go back. Change view. 
Here we go. Well, it really started back here. Look at this. Oh, I'm gonna come in on the inside. Get around him. He hits the wall up here. Here we go. Hey, look at this. Oh, man, look at that. Holy crap. Was that wild or what? Up to third in the dicey S's. I went from sixth to third in one lap. And really, just a sequence of corners. Pretty crazy. He got a penalty, so he's gone. He's putting a little bit of distance between fourth and me now. This view is so sweet. Look at that. Pretty wild. Wow. Oh, hit the wall. He's coming hard. I think he's on soft, so I just let him by me. Because I knew I was pitting. He was rolling. He was on softs for sure. And my mediums were shot. So I just stick with him a little bit. Slow up. Make my break zones. Head into the pits. And pick up a, new, a brand new set of softs for myself. That was great, man. Come into the pit, get soft tires, pit, get softs, and come out third still. Still P3, which was great. I had a big lead, like 14 seconds. Back out in third place on a brand new slicks. Really be able to extend the gap now. Then striking distance didn't have a chance with me. His tires were hot, but they were probably a little more worn than me. I don't know if he's on softs. He may be, because look at that. 
wait till I start getting a little bit of gap right here. That's a good shot. You can see the gap already starting to build. Oh yeah, he's getting real swirly. Look at that, man. It's a total difference between softs and worn tires. He may be on mediums. And the great thing was I was able to make the softs last for uh, six laps. Just about half of the race. In fact, I could have done softs both times. But I think they start you out on mediums. So I think that's the way to go. There's only one more race this season. Tokyo, uh, Blue Moon, which I also have never driven. <laughs> it seems to be that the tracks that I don't drive, I do really well. So I think that may be the plan for the GR3. Hold off on mediums and then switch to softs late. So we'll try that. Even though that is an oval, the tires may start to go more quickly because you're flat out around banking corners. So we'll just have to see... Flashing my lights because I'm coming on, coming up on a back marker. Even though I know he's ghosted, he may not know that. I'm just letting him know that, hey, I'm coming up hard and fast. In fact, I'm going to go right through him. Already lapping traffic. This is a very fast race. The pace was really quick. In fact second was like 13 seconds ahead and then on the last lap I was 13 seconds ahead of fourth so I was in this little bubble my own little private race which was fine with me I mean podium man get some good points Slowly trying to work my way back up to, or yeah, back up to A status. I had A last year for about two days. And uh, that was all she wrote. I've been B for about a year, almost a year. Well, I'll say this I've been B this entire year. But races like these, it will really help my uh, driver, I mean my SR rating, I mean my driver rating. Yeah, the softs are amazing. Oh, we'll hit the wall right there, even though I just said the softs are amazing on this track, and then I hit the wall. But they really are, man. You can just glide on these things, man, through these corners. Crazy. I bet I could get into the mid-119s on this track. It took about nine laps in practice for me to not have to worry about the track map and I could just focus on the corners because about nine laps I kind of started to 
get a sense of where I was on the track, what corners were what, where to brake, how to turn, the radius, the speed, the gear to be in. Yeah, but those first nine, man, I was like, oh crap, is this fourth gear, fifth gear? Oh, hit the wall. No, actually, it was the third gear corner, and I was in fifth gear. <laughs> After this, I'm going to do a race, I think, and then I'm going to eat dinner, play with my cat, I put my tree up, and every day I come home, she gets one cat ornament off the tree and takes it into my bedroom, and now it's already gone. I just put it back up. It's like our little game of hide and seek, even though she hides it in the same spot every time, which is right on top of the bed. <laughs> This almost kind of reminds me of that Pennzoil commercial called The Last Viper. It was also a yellow ACR like this. It didn't have any graphics on it. But man, was that car sweet looking. If you have not seen it, you need to Google Pennzoil Last Viper. Watch the video, you will be amazed. It is some of the most amazing footage I've ever seen. It's a short film called The Last Viper. And this reminds me a lot of it. Except it's way crazier. Third place! All right. All right. What a great, great race that was. Let's go check out my points. I have so far, it's only one more race left. Calculating, calculating, calculating. Hmm, I guess I'll have to come back tomorrow. Well, friend ranking, I'm fourth out of all my friends doing this season. Local rankings, obviously. First, first, first. entered a blocked scene. Weird. Alright guys, I might stream again, but this race is over for now. I will start a new stream for the daily race, Nürburgring 24, depending on how I feel during free practice. So stay tuned and check out that race always. Thanks for watching and I will see you on the track.